Hi guys, today we are at Beau Concept and we're doing a shoot for the Mark and Mandy show in Canadian Home Trends magazine where I do my quarterly room refresh. So what we do is we take a room, or in this case like a vignette, and then we bring it to life in a new and fresh way. So follow along and see what happens. This is a spring issue, so normally a couch like this, I would probably go in kind of the tones of the couch and maybe add greens and browns and burgundies and things like that. But I'm gonna go opposite to that because I want it, I want to lighten, I want to brighten. So I'm kind of going in some ways you may not think of. The first thing we did is we did change the carpet into a lighter carpet. There was a darker carpet there before. If you have leather, um, I think to have some texture and lightness in the carpet really helps. These are clear, so nice so they don't take up visual space. They got some black and some cement tones to them, which that cement's really on trend. There was a more fall, darker picture. Um, I just fell in love with this picture, so I thought, you know, I'm gonna make it work. And so that's kind of a tip with art. If you love it, it will work. So for me, this is just, I just thought this was so cool. And I was like, okay, this is my inspiration. <laughs> We're gonna build it around that. We put a plant. I made them move a plant from the other side over there because I think that just adds life and fresh and spring as well. And now we're just gonna add some like textiles to the couch and style it up to give it a little refresh for spring. Okay, so textiles in this tone to go with the print that I love. If it was fall, normally, just a little tip, I probably would have gone in these green tones, which I think the green with that brown leather would be a really rich look for fall. Um, but yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> it's going to be spring and it's gonna feel like spring. And I, and I just really like these colors too. And I think it's something a little different. And I think if you have a leather couch, and a lot of people do, a lot of clients I go to have brown leather couches actually. And you know what? Treat it like a neutral. I think if you treat it like a neutral, because brown is a neutral, and just bring in different textures, it'll warm it up and brighten it up right away. Maybe a sheepskin, because adding, you know, it's faux, but adding uh, anything like textured like this, again, will warm it up. try lots, go in the tones. We'll start with the pillows. And now let's go to the accessories because if you pick a color, like I can see I've gotten those um, blush tones and those mauve tones, you want to repeat it if you can three times. So if we've got it in the picture, we've got it in the textiles, then we want to repeat it in the like accessories. So that's a good rule of thumb. If you're going to change up the color, try and repeat it three times and then it'll look like you meant to do that intentionally. <laughs> Oh, oh, some gold. Okay. 
was like, actually, hey, I put it all in great. one corner. Okay, then awesome. Can I put it here? Thank you. Okay, let's do pillows first. This, you can put in any space, always warms it up, always adds texture, especially to um, leather, right? chop them that was the designer thing to get the right chop. now the big thing is to kind of like just make it disheveled like you were just sitting on a couch and the pillows just lying there and you know so anyway whatever is your style what you can do is go in the same tone so with pillows mixing and matching these are all solids um, I'm gonna go in the same tone so this is something you may not think of like whether it was blue or green you can use the same color it's just in the same color family so I'm gonna see we like the dark or the light and I'm feeling it's gonna be the dark but okay I thought the dark no I'm thinking and then I'd like to add this one just because it's a different shape because it's all the same color um, and they're all solids it'd be nice to add something in a different shape just to give it a little interest No. <laughs> so my tips are buy more than you need if you're trying and you can always just return them at most stores. Um, go with a color theme. So we didn't talk about pattern here. We can do that another time, but stick within a color palette, one to two colors, um, different sizes and shapes and just try them. Try them out because that's your best. And take a picture. That will help too. If you take a picture and then look back at the picture, you'll know right away. So I hope you enjoyed this room refresh at Bowman Concept. Thank you so much Pleasure for having me. Pleasure meeting you. You're welcome. Bye. <laughs>